Now we're going to do some examples. And first, Hilda's going to tell you about the saints that she would put in her litany of the saints. So, Hilda, who did you pick to put in your litany? I picked St. Hildegard, Mary, and St. Elizabeth. All right. And will you tell me why you picked St. Hildegard? I picked St. Hildegard be because... um. I really love her, and she's my real name. Yeah, Hildegard is your real name? Yeah. Yeah. Can you show them the camera? Can you hold it up so they can see? Here, I'll hold it up. This is St. Hildegard. <laughs> All right. And the back has a cauldron and the flower. Very nice. All right. Do you know why those are there on the back? No. Because Hildegard made medicine. That was one of the things that she did. She made medicine and music. Books. But she also has a book right there. Yeah, that's right. Do you know why she has a flame in front? Uh -uh. It's for the Holy Spirit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. So why did you pick St. Mary for one of your saints for your litany? Because um, I love her the most, and she's my middle name. Mary's your middle name? Yeah. How come you love her the most? Because she seems really special to me. That's great. And then, why did you pick St. Elizabeth of the Trinity? Because I have um, a friend that's a baby that, that's named Elizabeth. That's great. And some of these names were actually in your litany of the saints when you were <laughs> baptized. Um, we definitely had Hildegard of Bingen, and we definitely had St. Mary. Everybody has St. Mary in there. Of the saints. Thank you, Hilda. Can you say goodbye? Bye.